The 2015 Berenberg Gary Player Invitational Series got underway with pros, celebrities and businessmen from around the world invited to take part in the event played over Wentworth Golf Club's Edinburgh course. The nearby Penny Hill Park Hotel hosted the welcome reception where the star-studded Pro-Am lineup gathered in support of Gary Player and the various charities the Player Foundation helps to fund. <music> 2015 marks the 50th anniversary of Gary Player's career Grand Slam, but he's still going strong and using his global status to raise awareness and money for charitable causes. On the day itself at Wentworth, Gary Player was assisted by Solheim Cup star Charlie Hull, together putting on a skills clinic for the amateurs. With the Black Knight in typically energetic form, you'd never tell that Hull is 60 years his junior. You, you know what I call a woman like this? Sir! <laughs> Suzanne Pedersen, George Kutsia and DJ Spoonie also joined in the clinic. Teams consisting of businessmen, pros and celebrities competed on the Edinburgh course designed by Player himself and it was the members of the LPGA and Ladies European Tour who were lighting up the scoreboard early on. Carly Booth has long been a supporter of the Gary Player Invitational Initiative and was finding the Wentworth Greens to her liking. Charlie Hull was proving her game isn't just about raw power, demonstrating some short game finesse as well. Yes. Among the Champions Tour guests, boom boom, Freddie Couples. It's great for me personally to come and be a part of this and I think he does a phenomenal job, I really do, it's a, it's a blast and Wentworth is spectacular. The man's an inspiration to us all, I think, and that's why you see so many faces come to anything he does. Anything he asks us to do, we'll do it. He wants me to sing tonight, I'll sing tonight, because he's just the most incredible guy. He's still, you know, he's turning 80 and he's still, he's still doing it. Still doing charity work, still playing golf, still looking after people. He's an incredible human being. Yeah, it's lovely to see, you know, the greats of the game of golf, you know, contribute back um, and no one does it better than Gary. Well it's amazing he's 80 this year and you know how fit he stays and you know just how he speaks to people and he just the way he uh, represents himself. What a Anytime you support a legend of the game in Gary Player you know he asks you to to attend and support his charities and support people obviously less fortunate than ourselves, of course, uh, you try and help, of course. Fresh from an emotional farewell to the Open at St Andrews, another of the game's living legends, Tom Watson, was also there. The charitable aspect of this is magnificent and it's huge. And the, what uh, Berenberg and Gary Player have done, uh, bringing uh, golf to various communities around the world in the name of the charities of those communities. It's uh, wonderful. It's what we can do in golf to really uh, help other people. The main beneficiary of the event was DePaul UK, a charity that helps disadvantaged and homeless people. What I think is great, what the GPI events, wherever they raise money, the money goes to that uh, destination. So, uh, so actually traveling the world, uh, you feel like you can really make a difference. The principal sponsor of the GPI event at Wentworth was Berenberg, whose managing partner is Dr. Hans Walter Peters. We have the tournament here, we had already a tournament in Germany and we will have a tournament in October in New York. This is not only golf, this is also charity and to co combine both, uh, this is what you can feel well with that also afterwards. One of players' big aims is to raise $100 million for charity, and events like this go a long way in helping to achieve that goal. He even had a special caddy for the day. Well, Ian Poulter's son was supposed to caddy two holes for me and caddied 18, and it was so nice. At the home of golf. After a thoroughly enjoyable day of competition, the winning four-ball team was Ian Woosnam, Georgia Hall, James Grigg and Robert Bauer. 
I think all in all so far it's been a great success. Now tonight is what determines uh, how well the, the charities do and um, we're hoping that the, the people will dig deep into their pockets and uh, but they always do. So it was on to the gala dinner and auction, a fun and glamorous occasion with prizes on offer including a VIP trip to the Masters and a round of golf with Gary Player himself, all in aid of helping those less fortunate. When you struggle as a young person like I did to know what it is not to have things, it's a wonderful feeling to know that you're changing people's lives. A lot of fun was had over the course of the evening with some players singing better than others, but the emphasis was still on the union of golf and giving. Well, Gary Player may be turning 80, but he's still clearly got the moves, and the GPI series continues to have a huge impact around the globe, with this event raising over $225,000 for charity. Through the tireless work of Gary Player and Black Knight International, this is golf giving back.